You don't have to be smart No need to dress up For me to see That you're a good man You're a good man God, I had this shirt. I wonder if I need a camisole under it. Eh, a little see-through. Maybe I'll put one on. We're gonna head out to Hobby Lobby. Uh, while I was taking a shower, Hubby um, put all this stuff in the refrigerator. This is the ribs, they're done. I'm just gonna put barbecue sauce on it when I get home. And by the way, when I first started making the ribs with the parchment painter, I wasn't sure how that would work. Because you all know I don't like to use tinfoil because it can be toxic. Whatever. I know it's minor, but whatever. <laughs> um, I'm used to using parchment paper now. I don't even buy tinfoil. It works just fine. It, the ribs turn out good and whatever. And this is the unbleached parchment paper. I get it at Target. I'll put the link down below. Go and click on yesterday's video and you'll see part one of this video. I just decided to split it in two because it was too long. So... Um, I have my favorite Tervis mug, and there's a splash of, um, well, today there's a little more than a splash, of that Simply Watermelon. Everyone's talking about that stuff is good. So there's some ice water in here and the splash of, a couple splashes of the Simply Lemon Water. And Hubby has just got the Aquafina, and you know, do you notice the difference with this Aquafina? And the top. They, and the bottle. Yeah. So my sister said, I know... She gives me lots of info. She says it's best to drink water, bottled water from the harder um, containers, thicker. So they change their water. This is not as thick because the thinner water, the water bottles, will uh, your water will absorb more of the plastic than it would with the harder ones. So I'm not happy about that. We really need to look into getting that reverse osmosis. Maybe that'll help our water. So, the whole, we're still having a little bit of a water dilemma. It seems to be better. Um, we're not as itchy. <laughs> it seems to be fixing. The, we keep testing it, and the water's not as hard. Um, we've been having, in case you don't know what I'm talking about, since March and going back and forth. And we had the water guy come out twice and change out the salt. And, anyway. It seems better, but um, my hair is so dry and I have oily hair. It seems better today. Mm -hmm. All right, it's still kind of frizzy, so I need to deep condition it. I was gonna do the coconut oil, but um, yeah, I don't wanna do that. I'm thinking that's hard to get out of your hair. So I'll just deep condition it with my hair hair crack stuff so um i got my mask hubby has his mask i don't know what i do with my other one it's probably in the bottom of my purse which means it needs to be washed anyway so we're headed to hobby lobby and i still have some steps i need to check so when we come back from hobby lobby i might need to go for a walk <laughs> do you want to follow it's gonna be dark do you want to do you want to follow me in the golf cart no no yeah. yes okay just so i can get my steps in because I challenge people on the Facebook page. If you're not sure what I'm talking about, that's Walk Water Sunshine. I'll put the link down below. You can join um, to doing <laughs> three miles the next five days. And today's day two. And guess what? I cut Hubby's hair. I don't know if you've seen his hair really long. I don't think we took a picture. We should have took a before picture, but I cut his hair. And what did you say? Did I do a good job? You did a great job. I did a great job, he said. It's not bad, but he said it needs cut cut again in the back. You know, have a it's new a little job. too long, huh? You, I have a new job. Yeah, no, that was not fun. I don't want to do that. He just didn't feel comfortable going to the barber. I don't. I don't want to say you weren't comfortable. It just was <laughs> easier to have me do it than to go to the barber. Yeah, I don't know how you get your hair cut with those things on and all that. Yeah, you have to. It wasn't that bad. You just have to go and learn how. Whoa how everything's gonna work now and stuff i think once you do it one time you won't feel so bad you're good with me cutting it yeah. <laughs> okay so yeah i was uncomfortable too the first time that i went to Publix, and um i don't know 
it was fine when I went to get my hair cut. Though, actually, the first time I went, I, um, I thought I had an appointment, and I didn't. And they were wearing the shields, the plastic shields and stuff. And then when I actually got my hair cut this past Wednesday, they were just wearing masks. So, I don't know what changed. Why they are not wearing the shields. I don't know. Maybe that was step one. This is step two. I don't know. Anyway, we're headed to Hobby Lobby. And we'll see you, you don't in a bit. have to be smart. No need to dress up for me to see that you're a good So, I haven't been here in what? At least since March. Hubby says it's been a year. Yeah, I don't think we've been in here a really long time. Before March, for sure. I don't know. Anyway. We chose to go really late because we figured there wouldn't be that many people in here. And uh, we don't need to shop a whole bunch because we don't need stuff. But we wanted to come. Hubby's first time having to wear a mask. Is there an up and a down to this? No, I don't think so. That doesn't look symmetrical. Oh yeah, that's the top. That's the top. That's the top. Yeah. It's complicated. All right, let's go rob the bank. <laughs> oh, those chairs are pretty. Those chairs are pretty. I like that little table too. When you like get your dining room set and with these chairs. Oh, this is gorgeous. Like, where would I put it? I don't need it. I like it though. Steak. So what do you guys think about that instead of my entryway table? I don't really need the storage, <laughs> to tell you the truth, but it's pretty. You don't have to be smart No need to dress up for me To see that you're a good man You're a good man A real good man When the wind blows
guys. I'm looking to redo, maybe not right now, but I'm looking to redo, um, I'll have to show you when I get back home. That one wall, I've mentioned it before, where I have the photo, what do you call that? A photo, I don't know what it's called. It's like a photo divider, or I don't know what the heck the thing is called. I have all my photos in, in the entry way, sort of, by the dining room. So I'm looking to take that all down and get something new. This one, this is nice. This is really the first piece I've seen that it would be something I like. What is the price? $70. That's ridiculous. Oh wait, it's 50% off. So that's 35. What do you think? Do you like that, Ben? is I was looking for something with like um, little clips and stuff to hang for the photos. Although I could put one on here so I can easily change them out instead of having to do that. That's why it's a panel. I guess that's what that thing is. It's a photo panel. Three, three, I don't know. <laughs> I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about. So that's not easy to change out. Um, I do kind of like it though. Too. I like everything. I haven't been to the store in a while, can you tell? I'm also looking for, well that one's nice too. Some pillowcases. Obviously not going to find it in here. Um, that I seen on somebody else's video. They were like, who was it? It was Lynette. I don't know her last name. She's Amish. No, she's Mennonite. I don't know if you watch her channel. Her, the pillowcases she put recently bought were pretty cool. I kind of want it. But I don't see where the pillowcases are. Oh, good. These are all 50% off. If you guys don't know, you can download the app and there's always a 40% coupon on there. So don't ever buy anything full price. Of course, that's only good for one item. But usually I buy an item and then hubby buys an item. I know I can order them online, so I'm not seeing. Oh, is this that it or that one? I don't know. Hmm. They're fifty percent off too. Yeah, that's it. That's the one I want. So they're $17.99 and then they're 50% off. So now I have to decide when to get that other thing because there's only one left. You don't have to be smart. No need to dress up for me. To see that you're a good man, you're a good man. show you what I got when I get home but you saw what is in the cart so I only ended up getting like 500 steps out of that. and I am counting that because that's not something I would normally do 
which is all the more reason y'all should be walking because you're not, I'm guessing you're not going shopping and stuff like that. That's the first time I've been to any regular store. Yeah, I don't think I went. I went to Publix, that's it. I don't think I went anywhere else. Did I? No. Not even Home Depot or anything. So, I'm counting that as my steps. Oh, I went and got my hair cut. That was it. That wasn't a store. I'm not walking around in there. Hubby said I, could, I went and got my hair cut. Anyway, all right. Well, that was it. <laughs> Short little trip. It takes us, what, 30 minutes to get up here? Yeah. Yeah. So nice little car right actually not really it's on the highway mm -hmm. it's not exactly nice and we're not getting a frosted coffee on the way home like we normally would Suck. i'm not interested are you no. yeah after that frosted coffee i'm like nope nope I did however get some of these because i had to stand at the right in front of the you know the display that has all this kind of stuff plus i got some sticky tack and what was the other thing I got? Oh, Gorilla Glue because the 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 vent above the microwave broke, so I need to I need to glue it on because it yeah. Twenty five hundred steps is that right? So I still have twenty five hundred steps to do, and I don't. I was gonna go for a walk, but I took a shower. I don't want to get all hot and sweaty and stuff, so I just have to do it around the house walk around the dining table like another half a dozen times or something I could do a walking video never tried that maybe who doesn't have a seatbelt on me I had that kind of candy like Jolly Ranchers or that kind of candy in forever oh my god it's really good and really sugary it's but it's gluten free <laughs> fat free <laughs> What'd you say? You got sucked in. That's okay. What has been has been. There's no use in looking back, going back, wishing back. Cutting grass and chopping wood. Under the apple tree, this gentle man lay. Well, you're a good man, quite the best man. A real fine man. Task here, so um, I walked around the house, did some more steps, and um, put some barbecue sauce on the ribs and I'm cooking them for hubby. Yeah, it's almost nine o'clock. You know, we eat late. And um, I'll make him some corn. And I don't know what I'm gonna have. I might have some more of the frittata or I don't know, a salad or something. Anyway, and my video is uploading, but not now because I'm recording on my phone. So I have to stop recording so it will continue to upload. And I'm gonna walk around the house and get my steps in. <laughs> All at the same time and drink my water while I'm doing that and I also might um I also might um finish this video tomorrow morning because I have to make my thumbnail finish uploading the video and get it posted yeah yada 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 and um yeah I think that's what I'm gonna do I'll see you tomorrow. I am going to the park to go for my walk this morning. The good thing is, um, did I say it was eight o'clock? It's eight o'clock. Good thing is, is um, when I get home, I don't have to make breakfast. I can eat have the frittata, and I'm good to go. Much, much later, it is 2:24, and let me show you what have I been doing. Um, I didn't film, so I did a Sunday home refresh. Um, but I didn't want to film it because this would make this video too long and I just wanted to get it done and not film and move the camera around and all that stuff. So that straightened up, you know, I'm back to sheets on the couch because it was itching us because their skin is so sensitive. So whatever, <laughs> it'll work out. So that's all straightened up. I did some laundry. Um, 
I got the kitchen all straightened up. For the most part, I still need to do that and my planners and stuff. And I'll show you my list in a minute. And so the kitchen got all straightened up. I even cleaned the sink with bleach. It's looking better. I was impatient and um, yeah, I caved and used the bleach. And I should have soaked this side a little longer, but I didn't want to. Um, I cleaned the oven a little tiny bit, not all of it, and then the, that thing broke off. Hubby's gonna fix that for me. I bought some super glue. So this is all cleaned up. I got chicken out for dinner. So there's that. The only other thing is the laundry room needs straightened up and there's one more load of laundry. I'll do that later. This I decluttered the other day. Oh yeah, yeah let, me sh let me show you something. I'm gonna get rid of those and I'm gonna get rid of that blanket. And hopefully this week I'm gonna get that decor up there. And I didn't think to film. So I don't know, you might've seen in other videos, this was a mess. It was all crumpled up and this is where all my placemats and my table runners are. And so now I only have placemats in here. So um, I'm gonna show you. And I organized them and then got rid of those other four. Got some decor Places. a little bit. I put this here instead. Um, so I put all of my table runners in here. Um, yeah. So I wasn't really utilizing these drawers. There was just junk in there. So I cleaned that all out. And I can't really put placemats in here because they don't really fit, except for these placemats that are for when the kids come over because they're plastic. And so I have some more table runners in here. Obviously I have to fold them up. So I have all table runners in these two drawers. One thing I decluttered real quick the other day. So I'm gonna show you what I got at Hobby Lobby. So I still have the cart there because guess what? I'm gonna clean the craft room. <laughs> yes, because I need to get done. And hubby's gonna come in here and give me emotional support <laughs> in here why I, well, first I'm gonna edit the vid this video so you can see it. And I'm gonna start cleaning and organizing so I can get the taxes done. So all the bed got all made and um, the bathroom needs touched up a little bit, but I'm not gonna worry about it. So I'm just leaving that in there. So the house is all clean, it's Sunday reset and refresh. And um, yeah, I think I already put, let me show you what I got at Hobby Lobby. So I did go ahead and get this thing right here, this picture frame. So this, I don't know what you call this thing. I'm going to, I just want something different. I'm going to, I don't know if I can get rid of it. I've had it forever, but um, yeah, I'm gonna, going to get rid of it and I'm going to decorate it. I need some more pieces and I have been, oh, um, I dropped something. So I dropped my nail clip and one of the pieces, my nail clip, my ma nail kit. Oh my God, what's wrong with me? I can't talk. So um, I've been looking for pieces for to redo this, this, just this wall right here, down there. And I, I'm thinking that will make it look less cluttered. I don't know. Some of y'all will probably say, just don't put anything there. <laughs> but I want to put some pictures there. Um, so I've been looking for a while, just looking out, not like hard looking. Obviously, I haven't done anything for three months. But for like a year, I've been thinking about doing this. You might have remembered me mentioning it. Um, but I liked it because, do you see this, how it's, wood and then this metal I feel like it matches my home sweet home sign up here so that's what I'm doing there so and I actually have well I have another one of these shelves but it, it's over there I might could put it here because it really looks odd over there I just put it there for some reason I do like that it has my sister a picture of my sister on there and I really love this thing that I got a Publix <laughs> so it I don't think it really matches in here but I love that shelf that's from Hobby Lobby I don't know if they still have it I will put the link down below if they do I love I love that and that is why I bought those two flower things that I'll show you so so the other two um well, I bought those cherries uh, candy and then at the register I bought some glue for hubby to fix the vent on the um, uh, microwave and then I needed some more sticky tack whatever that stuff is called 
And then I went ahead and got the pillow covers. Let me take it out. I found this on Lynette um, Yoder, Yoder. Um, this video, um, I'll just put a link down below where she showed this. I just love it. So it was regularly $17.99. It was 50% off. That's a good deal. This is like really super nice quality. Really nice quality. So it's just a, it's just a cover. So I'm going to put it on the couch. Um, yeah, I have to, fun. I have way too many co couch cushions. The couch, I mean pillows. The couch came with a ton of pillows. So I need to find somewhere to store the extra ones. So I just bought two. I think that's plenty and I don't know, I just really like that. So that's what I got. The other thing and I got. I was looking for some copper and they really didn't. I kind of want to put some copper accents in the living room and the other day I was um, in the family room. I was playing around with the decor up there and I put that there and that there and now I'm not liking it. I think I just like it simple, but I'm wondering if I should move the flower and the candlestick over to here on the same there and spread it out. So I felt like I needed a third piece because you know how you're supposed to decorate in three, fives, and sevens, but the flower, <laughs> I think I need like a, a ginger jar or something up there. Oh, I don't know. I'll see, I wanted to use something I already have, but I don't know, I don't really have anything. And I thought I could paint the, um, I thought I could paint something I already have copper to put some copper accents in here. And, um, but when I saw these, oh my God, I just love them. They kind of match the corbels up there. And they're probably not gonna stay right there. They don't really, I don't really, I need some more heights. Something in between the flower and the candlestick, I think. I'll keep looking. I'm not gonna buy something just for the sake of buying it, but oh, obviously I just did that for this, but I love them. I love the look of it. I'm sure I will find the perfect place for them. And they were $11.99 and they were 50% off. So that was $6. And I think there was more of them. I just love the, the look of that. So guys, Hobby Lobby had, I, it almost looked like everything was 50% off, except for the fall stuff. But I asked it to register, and she said, no, not everything, a lot of stuff. So go now. <laughs> it's a lot, 50% off. Um, although there's, they always have a 40% um, coupon, but you can only use that on one item. Again, download the app for that. So, but right now, if you can't get to Hobby Lobby, you can go online. I'll put the link down below. It is an affiliate link, but, um, and you can get, uh, 50, you can get free shipping if you buy $50 or more stuff, which I did. That picture, that frame was too much money. I sh when I got to the register, I realized it was more than I thought it was. I guess I needed glasses. And um, I'm just gonna put this back up there for now. So I spent too much money. And um, so let me finish what I was saying. So you can go online to Hobby Lobby online. The link will be down below. And you can, until July 4th, you can order and get free shipping if you buy $50 or more. So, so they have, they still have my yum sign. They still have that. I bought that eons ago. You know how when you go to Hobby Lobby, they only have um, stuff for a limited amount of times. You go back and they don't have it again, which is why I buy that frame. Yeah, I got sucked in. Um, got chicken for uh, thawing out for dinner. I probably should put it in a in, in the sink in a bowl with some warm water so it can thaw. Anyhow, it was it was too much money, even with the fifty percent off. Well, I'll just tell you, <laughs> almost kind of embarrassed. I don't know. I can still, I could take it back if I change my mind, but I don't think I will. Like I said, I haven't found anything that I really liked for what I wanted to put some pictures in and stuff. Um, so yeah, I thought it said 69 and it said 89. Y'all, that cost me $45. I'm going to sit here and ask you, do you think that was too much? When well, I know in my head, that is too much and that's what you are going to say. Oh, uh, like I said, I could always take it back, but I probably won't. Hey, Pop. Go on. I need my emotional support now. Okay. I'm going to go get started on the, the craft room. 
hubby's gonna come in there and just hang out with me while I do it, cause I just, I don't know. Oh, I forgot to show you home refresh. So this is my July um, cleaning schedule. So there's that, um, you know what I'm talking about. I'll put a link down below It is my one and done cleaning schedule. It's like zone cleaning, but I modified it to work for me by cleaning two days, one week and three days next and only doing three zones. I divided the, ha the house in threes. Anyway, go watch that videos. And I think most of you already know what I'm talking about. I haven't had any new subscribers in forever and I keep losing. So if you like my videos, share it with somebody. I don't know what's going on with that. I think it's a pandemic. So I had a huge fail. <laughs> and I even have some of these crossed off, which I didn't end up doing. So I didn't really do any of my zone cleaning last month. But guess what? My house was still wasn't that bad. I did do cleaning. I just didn't do this schedule. I cleaned here and there. And I did a two Sunday, a Sunday home refresh. Um, whatever. I'm back on track. Now I was in a funk for like two weeks. The first week of June, I took a break cause I did May vlogs and I was tired. And then the next two weeks I had my head in the news and you all know what that's all about. And then here this week, I'm back on track. So I'm good. And I'm using a different, um, to-do list, daily to-do list now, because I tend to get complacent if I use the same list, I was using the steno pad, which I really did like because I can make a list on this side and that side. But these are ones that, a pad that I bought off of Amazon. If you're interested, I'll put the link down below. It just has all these little categories and stuff. So I can check off some of these things. So I made the bed. I'm doing laundry. I straightened up the whole house. Uh, I didn't do the freezer. The freezer is a mess, but I can always do that tomorrow. And I have to edit and post this video. And I had, I didn't really have any, I just had carrots just now. <laughs> that was my lunch. I probably should eat something else. Um, all right, gonna go in the room and start. A sneak peek of what it, what it looks like. Since the last time I cleaned it and did a video and I'll put a link down below. It got my step again. Remember the table was all clear and I took these flowers out because, oh, I forgot to show you that. Hold on. That thing was over here. So I wanted to put something here and it was perplexing me what to put. And I found this up in the cupboard. If you remember, I cleaned that out and put all that stuff up there. And then I didn't know what to put in there. And so these are some artificial flowers from my stash. And then I felt like I needed something, <laughs> something here, you know, threes. And I'm like, but I don't really have anything. And I'm like, well, make something useful. Put my essential oils out so it's out in my face so I remember to use them. So that's my little display. Good enough for now. I suppose I should clean that up. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> all right, so he's coming in here. And this is all the mess. So all right, makeup table needs to be cleaned up. I don't know, look, I left my rings and my bracelet in here last night when I was editing. And, uh, yeah. Oh, here's another one of these daily planners. I can put that with my other stuff. But I'm gonna do one basket at a time and I'm going to get started. Well, you're a good man, quite the best man. Real